YouTube, just want to say thank you everyone who is supporting the channel. Thanks for coming out, checking out the videos, but do me a favor and make sure you subscribe. All right, back to our show. YouTube, what's going on? Consumer Reviews and DIYs here back with another shoe review. And today we have the Nike Air Jordan 1 Ship PE. And this is going to be uh, a collaboration with Ama Manier and the Summit White and Black. We were able to come up on this uh, particular shoe in a size 11 and a half. This is retailing for $140. And you know, you can see on the box the Ama Manier logos. Um, we have an owner's manual. Okay, Airship. All right, so let's check it out. All right, so here we are uh, looking at the cushioning system, some details. This uh, shoe is supposed to uh, reduce impact shock. Didn't know that. Uh, next, we're looking at that polyurethane midsole, some details centered uh, around that. And the third page really goes into some details about the specific parts of the shoe. Uh, so if you are someone that's a collector or you're into these fine details, um, this is a shoe that you might, you might wanna pick up for the collection. So that's all that we have there. We got the Ama Manier paper, and it looks like each shoe is individually wrapped, which is it's just pretty consistent for these collaborations with uh, Ama Manier. All right, and they hooked us up with a couple of extra laces. All right, okay, then that lace goes exactly with that more distressed look. Even looking at the tongue, you have a more distressed look. Ama Manier under the Nike Air. The leather, okay, not too bad on the leather. We got the Ama Manier logo at the back. All right, we got the sizing on, on the inside. These are a lot of nice little details. Looks like the Jumpman, that looks like a 365 um, at, at the bottom. We got the black laces, we got the white laces. So you got a couple of different ways uh, that you can configure the shoe uh, to, to make it your own. Now, you guys know that we love to get some tumbled leather on the toe, you won't get it on this one. Uh, under the bottom, we got a more distressed look, kind of ashy black under under the bottom. But you guys, again, let me know what you think about this particular shoe in the comment section. Okay, we can't miss this. We have looks like a Amam in there logo. If you want to hook that onto the side uh, of the shoe, um, this isn't my favorite um jordan one collab but i mean i think it's okay you know it, it's not bad again you guys let me know what you think in the comment section make sure you like subscribe and i'll catch you in the next video